Right triangle trigonometry can be used to solve a lot of problems. Here's an example of one. A student looks out a second story school window and sees the top of a flagpole at an elevation, angle of elevation of 22 degrees. The student in the second floor of the school building is 18 feet above the ground and the distance from the base of the school to the base of the flagpole is 50 feet. The question here is, how tall is the flagpole? To solve this problem, we'll use some right triangle trigonometry. The sine of either of the acute angles in a right triangle is equal to the length of the opposite side over the length of the hypotenuse. The cosine of either of the acute angles is the adjacent side's length over the hypotenuse. And the tangent of an acute angle in a right triangle is opposite divided by adjacent. Let's begin. If you take a close look at the diagram given in this problem, you can see there's a right triangle formed kind of at the top part of the diagram. And in this right triangle, we know two parts in addition to the right angle. We know a 22 degree angle of elevation, and we know the length of one of the legs is 50. We're gonna begin by finding the side that I'm labeling with an X. This, isn't, this X is not the height of the, flag, the flagpole, it's basically just the height of the top part of the flagpole, but we also know that the bottom part of the flagpole, which is the height of the student above the ground, is 18. So if I can find the value of x, add that to 18, I'll have the height of the flagpole. So basically, I'm going to take a look at the right triangle at the top of this diagram, and I'm going to say, hey, I know a 22 degree angle, and across from that 22 angle, the opposite side, is side x the side that I want to find. The hypotenuse, I don't know the length of the hypotenuse and it's not relevant in this problem, but the adjacent side to the angle that is 22 degrees is given as 50. So I know one of the acute angles in a right triangle. I'm trying to find the side opposite to it. I know the side adjacent to it. So I'll take a look at the three trig functions and identify the one that includes the opposite and the adjacent which is the tangent. The tangent of either of the acute angles in a right triangle is equal to the quotient, opposite side's length divided by the adjacent side's length. So here, the tangent of the angle 22 degrees is equal to the length of the opposite side, which is x, over the length of the adjacent side, which is 50. So I now have an equation with one unknown. It will be fairly straightforward to solve for x. I'll begin by multiplying both sides of the equation by 50. 50 times the tangent of 22 is irrational, but if I'm going to round this off to the nearest tenth, I'll find that it is 20.2. The units in this problem is feet. This side x in this diagram to the nearest tenth is 20.2 20 feet. This is not the length of the entire flagpole, though. This is only the top of the flagpole. To find the measure of the complete measure of the flagpole, I'll have to take that 20.2, add it to the 18, the bottom part of the flagpole, which is 38.2. The approximate length of the flagpole described in this situation is 38.2 feet. 